ਹੋਸਟ ਨੂੰ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਇੰਟਰੋਡਿਊਸ ਕਰਾਣਾ ਚਾਹਾਂਗੀ ਟ੍ਰਿਸ਼ਾ ਅਰੋਰਾ ਸਸਰੀ ਕਾਲ ਟ੍ਰਿਸ਼ਾ ਸਸਰੀ ਕਾਲ ਹਾਊ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਆਮ ਗੁੱਡ ਹਾਊ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਗੁੱਡ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਇਟਸ ਨਾਈਸ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਯੂ ਅਗੇਨ ਔਨ ਦਿਸ ਸ਼ੋ ਵਿਦ ਮੀ ਇਟਸ ਅ ਪਲੇਜਰ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਯੂ ਬੈਕ ਪਲੇਜਰ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਹੀਅਰ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਐਂਡ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਟ੍ਰਿਸ਼ਾ ਆਪਣੇ ਗੈਸਟ ਨੂੰ ਨਾਲ ਲੈ ਕੇ ਆਏ ਨੇ ਜਿਨ੍ਹਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਅਸੀਂ ਗੱਲ ਕਰਾਂਗੇ ਜੈਸਮਿਨ ਸੇਠੀ ਸਸਰੀ ਕਾਲ ਜੈਸਮਿਨ how are you i'm great how it's are great you? good it's great to have you here now aaj ka jira topic is very interesting we're going to talk about balancing the culture kyunki ye dono kudiyan itthe hi jammi paliyan hagiyan they've been born brought up and raised here how are they juggling the cultures it's trying to keep the parents happy and trying to keep your friends happy which is a very big thing these days very hard. <laughs> so we're going to try to see ki as he kis tarah e apne cultures nu balance kar rahe ne and of course trisha is a teenager and jasmine you're now in college mm-hmm. so you've gone through this stage a stage to lanki to si utthe pahunche ho yes. so you're going to be able to tell us what were your pros and cons with this right excellent exactly. uh trisha will start with you sab to pehle assi tade to shuru karne ha you tell me ki e topic address karna tano itna important kyu lagya why did you think it's important to talk about this I believe it's extremely important just because a lot of people around here like a lot of children they don't really get to you know interact with their culture as much as say kids in India do or kids in London just mm-hmm. be- depending on where they live exactly like um Jasmine and I we've been living in Edison for a while so obviously there's a huge desi population over there there's not really that many problems but say if you're somewhere where there's not a big desi population then you know you know you interact with different people and you kind of forget where you come from and we need to be able to spread our culture to future generations well then let me ask you main tanu doan ek gal puchni ha kyunki tusi dono new jersey andar bought up raised ho you were always surrounded with indianness around you kafi tanu culture andar there was a mixture all the time so you didn't miss out on much on much what if suppose you were born in kalamazoo michigan <laughs> then what do you think the situation would be like I have family that lives in South Carolina. Okay. And um they really don't know much about their heritage. When I visited them, you know, I asked them, you know, do you watch Bollywood movies? Do you like Shah Rukh Khan? And they kind of looked at me like Shah Rukh Khan like <laughs> and for me, like that was such a big deal because I love Shah Rukh Khan. He's my favorite actor. I love Bollywood movies and they had no idea what I was talking about. So the culture there is very different. They're very Americanized and they don't, you know, they don't eat Indian food all the time like we do and It's very different. They're very Americanized. Well, talking about Indian food, then let me ask you something silly. How many times a week, Tanu Lagda, do you have Indian food for dinner? Oh, most probably maybe like six days out of the week. <laughs> really? In my family, it's like three, three to four times a week. Really? Yeah, we try to mix it up every now and you then. You try to mix yeah. it up every now and then. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. So then let me ask. ਤੁਸੀਂ ਮੈਂ ਪਹਿਲੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਪੁੱਛਾਂਗੀ ਐਂਡ ਦੈਨ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਫਿਰ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਗੈਸਟ ਨੂੰ ਇੰਟਰਵਿਊ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਹੋ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਮੈਂ ਦੱਸੋ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਕਿ ਯੂ نو ਬੀਇੰਗ ਬੋਰਡ ਅਪ ਹੀਅਰ ਯੂ ਵਰ ਬੋਰਨ ਹੀਅਰ ਰੀਅਲੀ ਬੋਥ ਆਫ ਯੂ ਤੋ ਇਥੇ ਰਹਿ ਕੇ ਹਾਊ ਡਿਡ ਯੂ ਬੈਲੈਂਸ ਥੀਸ ਟੂ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਆਈ ਮੀਨ ਡਿਡ ਯੂ ਗੋ ਥਰੂ ਐਨੀ ਰੇਸ਼ੀਅਲ ਡਿਸਕ੍ਰਿਮੀਨੇਸ਼ਨ ਵੈਨ ਯੂ ਵਰ ਗਰੋਇੰਗ ਅਪ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਸੀ ਕਿ ਸਕੂਲ ਅੰਦਰ ਬੱਚੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟਲੀ ਟ੍ਰੀਟ ਕਰਦੇ ਨੇ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇੰਡੀਅਨ ਹੋ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਅੰਦਰ ਕਾਫੀ ਇੰਡੀਅਨ ਪੋਪੂਲੇਸ਼ਨ ਹੈ ਬਾਈ ਦਾ ਵੇ Uh yes hey. there is now in Edison but you know in my old town I was the only Indian in my school okay so then tell me ki tada experience us de andar kis tarah reha how did people adapt to it how did people perceive you and how did they accept you and before you answer that main apne viewers nu eh bhi dasna chahwangi ki agar tade bacche show dekh rahe ne you have teenagers at home or younger kids jo show dekh rahe ne please do call us assi tade bhi views sunna chahwange how is it ki tade bacche itte kis tarah adapt kar rahe ne and what are some of the differences and problems that they're facing maybe you guys can answer the questions for them so please do call us with your comments and questions as well so trisha go ahead and tell me well i have to say it was very difficult the first few years you know um since i was the only indian in the school everybody assumed that indian meant that i lived in a teepee <laughs> till about third or fourth grade so It was kind of tough explaining to, you know, a, l- a bunch of little kids <laughs> what being Indian actually meant. And that, you know, I did perform at the cultural programs at my school and everything and I kind of got weird looks. Uh-huh. But I got used to explaining it and you know, I would have the younger kids come up to me and be like like, you know, give me 
comments, give me extremely rude comments at times. Mm -hmm. But I kind of just learned to deal with it. And then once I moved to Edison, since there was such a big Desi population, I didn't really have that kind of problem anymore, except okay. for, the, some, for some of the kids calling me too Indian. Really? <laughs> you can be too Indian? I didn't know you could be too Indian. What do you mean? Um, what, what were you doing that was making you too Indian? Um, first of all, I'm president of the South Asian club at my school. You guys have a South Asian club? Yes. You must have a society. lot of Indians, that's right. <laughs> okay. And I'm known as the person that would probably burst out in the hallways doing bhangra. Really? <laughs> if I'm in a good mood. I was on the tennis team. Every time I would score a point with my partner, I would end up doing bhangra on the tennis courts. <laughs> okay. And <laughs> All right. Jasmine and I, um, we actually go out for papri chat at least once a week. <laughs> really? Yeah, we, have, we call it a papri chat date. <laughs> really? Yeah. And which day is that? So we'll join you next time. <laughs> Usually Sundays. 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 All right, yeah. Sundays with you guys. Okay. Mm -hmm. So then tell me, how, did you feel weird when you were doing this? I mean, I'm sure bachi tanu dekde honge. Now let me ask you, jadon tanu lo can they see ki you're too Indian? A thode desi friends tanu can they see? American friends can they see? Surprisingly, it was mostly Desi people. Really? Yes. Okay, so they're the ones who thought you were too Desi for them. Yes. Did they still want to hang out with you? Ya tanu, tadinal, okay, Desi. It's better to stay away from her. Uh, well, some of them, you know, they tend to, they tended to keep away. But I realized that it's the true friends that I have that would really want to stick with me no matter which way I am. Absolutely. And I'm glad to say Jasmine's one of those friends. 